So y'all look at this here and see what you think. I'll tell you the story about it. But I don't want to tell you all at once. I'll let y'all look at it a little bit and then we'll talk a little bit more about it. So I'll just hush up for now. And uh, then we'll talk some more. Oh, you might notice uh, there's my name on that. Somebody made this for me. There's a guy named Tom Frost who lives in Michigan. He's one of the first people I ever met on the YouTube about eight years ago. He had a Ford tractor with a flathead V8 in it, an old Ford 8 in it. And uh, there was a video he was watching of somebody out in the snow doing donuts on their Ford tractor with an 8 in and a flathead V8. And me and Tom got talking about that and one thing led to another and we got to be friends. And he told me that uh, one of the things he liked to do was make banjos. And uh, that was years and years ago. And, uh, he told me at some point he's, he's working on a project for me, but he never did tell me what it was. So, anyway. I came home last night and there was a package in the mail and I opened the package and this banjo was inside of it. Every bit of this thing, well not every bit, because the, the, the hubcap's off of 41 Ford and that head was made by Remo, obviously, but that aluminum piece there, that's all cut out by hand and hand drilled and hand shaped and hand filed. And look at them inlays. It's all done by hand. This is a craftsman here. It's done, made up a special banjo just for me. And he said, well, I told him, I called him up. And I said, you know, I pay you something for this. It's a nice banjo. And he said, no, nah, I just made that for you because we were friends and you always been nice to me and I just wanted to do something. I like to do things for people. So anyway, he said, you know, just when you go to a car show, just take that with you and play it. And, you know, think about me and all, and uh, I will. Boy, that's, that's mighty nice. I mean, that's, I, you don't expect somebody to go to that much trouble. I, I know he's been talking about this for years, and I think he's been working on it for a long time. He said he built two like this. He built this one for me, and he built another one just like it. It's going to the Ford Museum. I believe he said in Dearborn, Michigan. So... There's going to be two of these that exist in the world. It's going to be the one I got and the one that's going to be at the Ford Museum. So, that's pretty dang special right there. I'll stop talking just to let y'all look at it a little more. Oh, I will say one more thing. Uh, when I told him that I'd offer to pay for it, you know, told him just tell me what, you, what it's worth. He said, you know what I'd like for you to do? He said, my folks like to hear music on a gospel song, and I ain't got no videos up. He don't really have any videos. And he said, if you just take it and make a video playing a gospel song that my, parent, that my uh, family could see, that'd be real nice. So I'm definitely going to do that. You know, it's like asking me to eat a hamburger. I mean, it's something I love to do, play gospel music on a banjo. So I'll be doing that all over the place. In fact, you'll probably see me playing this banjo here and there and everywhere because it's a fine one. I'm happy about it. I'm real delighted and I feel very blessed. So, amen and hallelujah. I hope all of we all are having a happy day and y'all have fine blessings of your own. Take care now. <laughs>